Hey everybody, MTG Magpie here, and we are back with a lovely I call you a scrub box, I guess. They're not called that, they're draft boxes, aren't they? Uh, this one came uh, waving in the breeze. It's uh, a handy opening measure. I mean, I'm not complaining about it, it means I'm not going to scuff my nails on it, but uh, it's got a handy dandy opening port, basically. So the, the, uh, the bonus card is not going to be any good because it's been checked, right? Well, you've just got to hope it's not bent. Yeah. So, nice. let's take a look at it and see if it's... Grease, uh, no, you're okay. You it's know. flat. It's... Wow, yeah. It they're is. like... <laughs> Why is it thin? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> just put like a top loader in there or something. Oh my god, look at the, 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 the things. Oh, it's so cute. What is this? It's a marmoset, right? Yeah, I think that's the marmoset, yeah. It's so cute. We're going to go with our traditional 12-pack, uh, 12-pack, 12 12-pack. 12 I don't know when we're opening this. At some point, we will open that. <laughs> Not in the first watch, video. Watch the though. rest of the videos to find out. Oh, that's a displeasing uh, side shot of packs. What art gives it that effect? Oh, okay. Mm, that's not very pleasing from the uh, side angle. But anyway, let's get into this. Nobody cares. Move on. All right, you can go away if you're going to be mean. Oh, the little punch tokens. Yeah, that's how you get rid of the, uh, get around the old counter thing. Uh, we've seen quite a few of the commons and uncommons, so we'll probably just be sort of, you know, dancing through them. Momentum Rumbler, Reconnaissance Mission, Valiant Rescuer, Lutri the Spell Chaser. Oh, he's so cute. Banned. Well, he's not banned in standard or anything. No. You can play him there. But banned in the formats that matter, move on. Oh. <laughs> You're so mean. Dismal Batwater. And yeah, this is the handy dandy uh, punch token thing. It's kind of cute, actually. I'm going to say I kind of like this. Reminds me of the Almond Cat one. No, we yeeted those. We did yeet those. But We're we, not don't good. Yeet we, we don't these. yeet these. We might actually need these, so I'm not going to yeet this. Although I may paint them with holographic nail polish so they're shiny. You paint everything you can with holographic nail polish. I know. I saw someone who painted their keyboard with it and it was like... <laughs> Hmm. No. An excellent idea. I think it's an excellent idea. All right, we have a Ketria crystal, a jubilant skybonder, an archipelago with the fancy art. You said the name right again. I know. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. A shark typhoon. <laughs> Such a meme. I think we've got a foil. So oh. I'm excited immediately. Uh, we have a land. We have a foil cunning night bonder. Oh, the foils are doing nothing today because we got rid of the sun. Can I like cheat and be like, oh, okay, that's kind of magical. Well, it's blinding me too. Excellent. Ah. Perfect. We'll maybe do that with the foils. Maybe. Just give them their moment to shine. Otherwise, they're not really going to shine. It's too bloody bright outside. Oh, look, it's a Mitri advertising the Commander decks. <laughs> they're not really in stock at the moment, but, you know. Okay, we already got ours. Ah, uh, three. Yep. Two. Well, Third one's still somewhere. Fight is one. Frill Scare Mentor. Sonorous Halbonder. Ooh, Riel, the Everwise. That's a cool card. That's a really sweet mythic, mainly because we haven't opened one already. So that's a really sweet mythic there. We'll pop her up there with the foil. A Tranquil Cove and a Beast. Uh, on to the next one. So one mythic in, one foil. It's not bad so far. I'm getting a good feel from this box, hopefully. Uh, we have a Migration Path, Huntmaster Liger, Savar Thundermane, and Colga, the Titan Ape. Yeah, King Kong. It is King Kong. I'm very excited to own a King Kong. I know, you wanted one of those. An Island and a Human Soldier.
Oh, we've got another punch card. Yeah. I'm quite excited about the punch cards for no particular reason other than they're sweet. Uh, Call of the Death Dweller. Flourishing Fox. Titaneth Rex. Ooh, Narset of the Ancient Ways with the non-freaky face. And the high kick. High kick and birds. Are those <laughs> birds? No, they're dinosaurs. Of course they are. Well, they're, maybe they're bird dinosaurs. Maybe I maybe. could get away with that one. That's mm. pretty sweet. <laughs> Mythic number two there. I think we have a foil, maybe. We have a foil. Zerda the Dawn Waker. Let's get some... White on her. Ooh. She's so pretty. That's a nice one to have, foil companion. That is a nice foil rare to get. Mainly because we haven't seen a Zerda yet. No. So that's really exciting. She's so cute. Aww. <laughs> Little foil fox. Uh, ooh, brush wag. I really do like the art from this set. It, it's a great set. It's definitely one of my favourites so far. Survive Crystal. A Bone Lard. A bone Lard. I did that last time. You did. A blo Bone Lard Yerker. You can't do it either. <laughs> anyway, this is cool. It's really cool in foil though. A Chittering Harvester. Karuga, the Macro Sage. It's a big old hippo. Yes. Pretty neat. A Plains and a Human Soldier. I think most of the tokens in this set are Human Soldiers of some form. Because oh, okay. that's why I wanted a dinosaur set to have lots of humans. Hmm, look at that advertising. <laughs> really? That's the advertising we're going for? Jesus. Oh, and they're even like... Oh man, that's so weird. Ooh, I don't know how I feel about that. Hmm. Oh, it's the Vulpakeet alternate. This is such a cute alternate art. It's adorable. Uh, we have a Zargoth Mamba. A Rooting Moloch. Channeled Force. And Emergent Ultimatum. The one with the Beastie Boys. And a bird. It's a cool card. I quite like the ultimatums. I think they're pretty neat. Ah yes, it's a cat token. So what does that stand for then? Because they're marked that I'm so confused about what that stands for. That's just weird. That's weird, wizards. That's really weird. Don't know if I'm a fan of that. Alright, let's skip on through all this stuff. We have Escape Protocol, Grim Dancer, General's Enforcer, Gem Razor. That's a sweet little rare there. I think we've got a foil. It's a foil jungle hollow. Those are some foily eggs there. Let's just get some light on that just so you can appreciate how foily those eggs really are. Wow, those are looking cool. Okay, neat. Uh, oh, it's the companion thing. I think this is really cute. What's that? It's just a place where you can put your companion. Oh, okay. So like the on an adventure from... Yeah, That's you just right. pop it down. Pop your companion on there. Uh, I think that's cool. Interesting. It's, I like the art on it. It's mm. neat. I was excited to see one of these. I don't know. I just think the little things like that are neat. Like the on adventure one was cool. And... Um, Oh, I see. Here's another ad. Is this? Oh, yeah. So what? Are they like, collect all the ad cards? Because that's a thing I'm interested in. Jesus Christ. All right. Well, we do have a collection of ad cards. So. We do, but they've never been numbered. <laughs> Blitz of the Thunder Raptor. Monstrous Step. Footfall Crater. Kenrel. No, oh, Kenrel. General. General Kudro of Draineth. This is our third mythic, so Jesus, either we're getting a lot of mythics or this, this part of the video is going to be mythic heavy. Yeah, this usually happens to us. <laughs> yep, the first one's always really good and then no one bothers to watch the other two. That's fine. It's fine, we'll, we'll, we've got the, uh, the bonus booster. 
Bonus booster, yeah, we'll use that in the boring part, eh? Yeah. Yeah, these are not bad mythics so far, though. Aside from the NAR set, which you've already got. They're two right. new ones. Skipping on through. Skipping on through. Uh, Storm Wild Caprador. Bone La... <laughs> I hate this card so much. Boneyard was... Lurker. Boneyard Lurker. Boneyard Lurker. <laughs> Tongue twister for you. Blair. 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 Archipelago. But you can say that fine. Mythos of Vadrock. Hmm. This is a cool one, this one. I reckon this one looks really good in foil because it's got the blue on it and it's, I reckon that's going to be sweet. But yeah, nice. A mountain and a human soldier. Honestly, the number of times you have to go and a human soldier in this video is going to be ridiculous. All right. You passed the bushwhack. Yeah. You didn't bring any attention to him. No, he doesn't always need attention. <gasps> Reptilian Reflection. Void Beckoner. Back for more. Urian. Urian. Yo, Ryan. Yeah, yeah, Ryan. The Sky Nomad. He's a bird serpent and he's really cool. He's a lot of fun. Wouldn't know. Don't own one. <laughs> and uh, the little punch card things. I'm going to punch those out and like carry them around. Throw them at people. Yeah. Vigilance! That would be funny. It's this stay alert campaign. <laughs> Just throw vigilance at people. It'll be fine. Obviously, from two metres away, you got to practice your trick shots. Yeah. But Boon of the Wish Giver. Insatiable Hemophage. Proud Wild Bonder. Titan's Nest. This is that funny... Oh, yeah. Very interesting X card. ...spell card. I don't know. And uh, Yeah. A weird one for sure. I think we've got a foil. Ooh, it's a foil swamp. I'm pretty sure we've seen this one in the uh, other box, but the crystals are foily. I'm going to pick up a whole bunch of foily crystals, I think. And look, and a human soldier. What do you know? So, part one, over and done. Pretty good. Three mythics, foil rare, smattering of other foils, some solid rares there. I think we're doing okay. Good start. Uh, we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye.